Hello and welcome to this video where I will show you how to install Kibana on Mac for Elasticsearch. So first navigate to the Elasticsearch website which is at elastic.co. Go to the products menu point and then to Kibana. And here we'll click the download button and if you scroll down you'll see that you have various options for downloading Kibana for your particular platform. So in this case, choose Mac. Then once the file has been downloaded, navigate to your command line. Or you can also extract the archive in your finder by locating the file and double clicking it. But I'm just going to do it on the command line here. So I'll use the tar command dash zxvf and then the name of my archive. So I'll hit enter here and this might take a short while because we have a lot of files to extract within the archive. So let's just wait for this to finish. Now that the archive has been extracted, let's navigate to the directory that was extracted from the archive. And the first thing we have to do is to make a slight change to our configuration. So let's navigate to the config directory. And in here we have a file named kibana.yml. And I'll open this up using vi, but you can open it with any text editor that you would like. And in here we have to navigate to the line that starts with elasticsearch.url and uncomment this line. And let's just make sure that the value is correct, pointing to our Elasticsearch cluster. In my case, the default value is okay. So I'll just save this file. And I'll go back to the root of the Kibana directory and I'll go to the bin directory. In here we have two files. One is named Kibana and one is named Kibana.bat. Kibana.bat is a script for Windows users, so I'm going to use the Kibana file here. So I'm just going to write period slash Kibana to start it up. And after a short while, Kibana should be started up. Note that your Elasticsearch cluster should be running at this point before standing up Kibana. So make sure that's done. Now Kibana is ready. I'll go to the browser and let's navigate to localhost at port 5601, which is where Kibana will be running. So I'll hit enter and wait a short moment for Kibana to load up. And now, as you can see, we're in the Kibana interface. So to configure an index pattern requires that you already have indexes in your Elasticsearch cluster. If this is the case, then you can just add an asterisk down here or just the name of your index, but that's out of the scope of this video. So as you can see, Kibana has been correctly installed and it's ready to use. So that's all for this time. If you like this video, please press like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.